Tales of supernatural powers and mysteries have always been a top priority in gatherings. Especially the nine-tailed fox, a species considered to be the most beautiful and powerful. The interesting story is so captivating that even Alicia, the fox with just one unique tail, was drawn to it. No, a nine-tailed fox cannot be real. The nine-tailed fox! The nine-tailed fox has harmed people! <gasps> no, it can't be true. According to Lucky Eyewitness who survived, the nine-tailed fox is the culprit who harmed a demon hunter living in the edge of the forest. Elysia was about to defend her fellow species when a demon hunter intervened. Huh? There must be something fishy going on. The fox tribe prohibits harming humans. But prejudice is still prejudice. With suspicious and doubtful uh -huh. eyes, along with whispers, the rumor spread even further. Uh -huh. To restore mm -hmm. the purity of her tribe, huh? Alicia mm -hmm. greeted and teamed up with Felix to uh -huh. uncover the truth behind it. Mm -hmm. It was dark, and huh? Alicia led Felix into the forest. Mm -hmm. The wind started to pick up, and a pair of cold, menacing eyes appeared interminately in the darkness. The behavior of the owner of those eyes was very mysterious, forcing Alicia to exert all her strength to resist. However, the power of that person was too formidable, and Alicia was no match for him. Huh? Alicia's father and brothers appeared in time and immediately took Felix back to the human town. The wind stopped blowing and the stranger disappeared. Alicia only managed to pick up the mask that the person dropped. Stop it! Huh? Don't do anything pointless! Huh? Mm. Feeling that her father was hiding something, that night, Alicia secretly followed him out of the house. Alicia's father sneaked deep into the forest and stopped by a dark and eerie ancient temple. Behind a mysterious screen, the graceful and charming silhouette of a girl appeared faintly. <laughs> one who has harmed the demon hunter under the town? Was it you, Daria? If it was, then what about it? Nine tails, oh my god! Elysia was extremely shocked, not huh? believing her own <gasps> eyes. Who's there? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Alicia's huh? father recognized his daughter and quickly stopped her. Ah! Huh? 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 Ah! I don't want to wear it anymore. I don't want to. Alicia. Leave here quickly! Huh? Huh? Dahlia, stay still inside the temple, and don't try to step outside or else. But I can't wait anymore! Huh? Huh? Alicia asked her father on the way back. Unable huh? to hide it, he told her a story mm. and warned her to keep it a secret. This happened 20 years ago. At the time, Lion of the Nine Constellations was still the clan chief, and he possessed great power. Thanks to him, 
the Fox Clan became one of the most sacred and noble clans. <laughs> However, Brian also had a weakness. <gasps> On the first moon day, his power would completely disappear. He was saved by Dahlia, the weakest human girl in town, who was being chased by the demon hunter. <clears throat> when he recovered, Brian returned to the forest and, knowing the difference, decided not to have anything huh? to do with that girl anymore. <laughs> Dare to hide from us huh? monsters? <laughs> Tired of living? Huh? But when he heard Dahlia's familiar scream, <laughs> Brian couldn't resist and rescued her back to the forest. They loved and happily welcomed their child's birth. <laughs> One day, tragedy happened. Dahlia was tricked to return to the village and became a hostage to lure Brian out. Release her, and I'll do whatever you want! One for one. Then how about two? If you... No, Brian! Please go, leave huh? me! I'm also human. They won't harm me! Ah! Huh? There's no other way. Brian, use all your strength to transfer the precious spirit of the fox to your wife. He's weakening! Quickly take the chance to destroy him! Huh? My son, you must protect your mother for me. By the time I arrived, everything huh? had already happened. I was only able to save Dahlia and the newborn ah. child. <laughs> huh? Dahlia became a half-fox due to the transfer. Wake up, my love! How can we live without you? Uh, just sleep for a while. Everything will be fine. Uh, half-foxes are very dangerous. They can easily turn into demons if they can't control their emotions. However, Brian, my dearest blood brother, loved her. I can't bear to destroy Dahlia. <gasps> They have been taken to the secret location of the Fox Clan for treatment. Please wear this mask and wait here. This is the only hope for Dahlia to survive until now, and it also somewhat restrains her from becoming a demon and destroyed humans. Dahlia will live alone like this for days and months. Till the day she becomes stronger and can escape on her own. She went to the village, seduced the bad demon hunter, and separated his family to ask him to remove the mask. Huh? Hm. Dahlia unleashed her power and hurt the demon hunter, but it seems that this was not enough. She wanted to revenge everyone who was there that day, or even worse, all humans. Everything has gone beyond my control. It's time to discuss this with the whole clan. Alicia, huh? you stay here and keep watching for any anomalies. Mm. Mm? After a while, Alicia saw a bright light shining from the temple huh? and ran towards it in fear. Half an hour ago, while Alicia and her father huh? were talking, Felix had followed the trail and found the Nine-Tailed Temple. Huh? Mm. Since Alicia's father's seal only worked on those one with magic, mm. Felix easily entered. Mm. Huh? Huh? 
before losing consciousness, I saw that face. So, so familiar. He reached out to take off the mask as Dahlia had instructed. But Alicia arrived just in time to stop him. Stop! You dare to interfere with my plan? I must take revenge and absorb their life force. Only then can I wait for the day my husband returns. I have done nothing wrong. They destroyed my family! Stop this madness. Even if you do anything, your husband has already left. Revenge will only turn you into a demon. Unexpectedly, after hearing this, the Nine-Tailed went crazy and began to lose her mind and slaughter those huh? around her. The huh? pain not only turned her into a demon, but also shattered the mask she was wearing to pieces. At this time, Alicia was no longer a match for Dahlia. She and Felix were on the brink of death. At this moment, the veil covering Felix's face flew off, revealing a face that looked exactly like Ryan's. Dahlia vaguely noticed something unusual and quickly stopped. But it seemed like it was too late. Felix was barely breathing. In agony, Dahlia held Felix and rushed outside to seek treatment. But the fox tribe arrived. Please let me save him! Once I've saved him, I will go with you. Please, even if you want my life, I beg you. Huh? Mm. Hmm. Alicia's father took Felix for treatment while Dahlia was imprisoned. Alicia later visited Dahlia and told her about Felix's condition. Thanks to receiving timely treatment, his condition improved and he was out of danger. Please let me borrow your body to see him. Just once is enough. Then I will fulfill my wish and leave. Huh? Without huh? waiting for Alicia's agreement, huh? Dahlia's soul gem escaped huh? her body and entered Alicia's body. Mm. Under the guise of Alicia, the nine-tailed fox met Felix mm. and he told her his story. Hmm. Finally, mm. Felix became human thanks to his foster uncle huh? in the Demon oh. Hunter team who always reminded him that the fox tribe was not evil and not to harm them. For years, Felix had carried a painting of his mother with him until he met Dahlia. Do you resent your parents for not being able to take care of you? I'm grateful to them for bringing me into this world to discover interesting things. I am happy. Knowing the answer, Dahlia smiled and left Alicia's body. Huh? Thank you for letting me borrow your body. I don't want to become a demon. It's time for me to go. Hmm. But what about Felix? He has grown up. I have to let go of the hatred and look forward to a better future. Who knows? Brian is waiting for me to be reborn. Before Dahlia disappeared, huh? Felix seemed to have a hunch and ran outside. So the two mothers and their son smiled and said their first and final goodbyes. Back home huh? that night, Alicia heard a voice <laughs> urging her repeatedly. When she opened her eyes, she appeared next to the ancient temple where Ninetales once lived. As soon as Alicia touched the ancient tree, huh? her body suddenly transformed. Huh? At the same time, the ancient tree shook and opened a strange portal. On the other side, a man <gasps> rushed out. It was Chad. Huh? Didn't I defeat you already? <laughs> wow, <Well, here> it goes. <laughs> <laughs>
a few of the eyes which could see miraculous things that people couldn't see. Hmm. What would you do? On the current story, Prince Carwin had special eyes like that. And that's what made his touching looks <laughs> true. However, uh? this special ability was uh? also the reason why people huh? kept away from him. Hmm. Do you see Prince Carwin there? Yes, he's mm -hmm. dreaming again. I don't know whether he really sees strange things or he just has the problem with his mind. Who knows it? But we'd better not come near him or we might be harmed by those weird things. Corwin got mm. used to the rumors behind his back and didn't care much about them. He just enjoyed <laughs> his miraculous world of his own. When the winter came, he usually went to the riverbank and played flute, like waiting for someone to come in here. The melodious sound of this flute attracted a snow huh? spirit nearby. The sound of this huh? flute is so great! <laughs> Thank you, I'm glad that you liked it. Huh? You can hear me? <laughs> I can also see you and the other spirits. It looks like you are favored by the gods. They gave you a great huh? ability. If only everyone around me could think like you. I'm so sorry to hear that. <laughs> I feel that we're very much alike. Hope that my sound of flute somehow can help you. You played flute for me? I have always watched the way you created seasons. <laughs> the other spirits are always welcome. Huh? Huh? When huh? you are hated huh? by everyone. Some of them even want me to disappear? Because they haven't known about the benefits that you brought to them. Look! What huh? a beautiful scene that you created! Mm. Moreover, <laughs> the cold of the winter also brings people closer. <laughs> you really know how to comfort others. My name is Era, and you? <laughs> Just like that, they joyfully talk to each other. <laughs> and they gradually <laughs> fell in love with each other without knowing that. <laughs> 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 Time for winter quickly passed by, but the winter spirit didn't want to leave. She wanted to be with Carwin, making the winter there last longer. I don't know why this winter lasts for so long. Our food reserve is going to run out. If things keep going like this, we won't make it through! Knowing that, the Snow Queen was huh? really angry. She decided to go find Aira by herself. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Huh? Snow Spirit, winter time is over. Why don't you come back? Do you know that your stupid action badly affected the life of people here? Huh? My queen, I just want mm. to be with Carwin for a little bit longer. <laughs> mm. I've always been forbidding all of you for not falling in love with human. But you still mm. broke the rule. You will be punished. You will never be allowed to be here anymore. Then she imprisoned Snow Spirit <laughs> into a block of ice yeah. and took her away. <laughs> huh? Huh? Carwin didn't know how to find Aero. Suddenly, he saw Flower Spirit flying by. Huh? Flower Spirit, please tell me where I can find Snow Spirit. It's useless. Even when you can find her, because the Snow Queen is really strict, she won't let you take her away. I will try by all means, even there's only a glimmer of hope. <sighs> Cross that river, you'll reach an ice mountain. The Snow Queen is on top of that mountain. The route will be difficult and dangerous. Be careful! Thank you, thank you so much! After many days of walking without taking a rest, uh, huh? finally huh? Harwin reached the palace huh? of the Snow Queen. Mm. <laughs> huh? You have guts. You dare to come here? 
Please allow me and the Snow Spirit to be together. Oh. I really love her with all my heart. If so, just use your love to rescue oh. her. <laughs> huh? Carwin tried his best hmm? to break the ice block. Huh? However, <laughs> even when his arm was bleeding, <sighs> the block was still the same without a scratch. Surprisingly, a drop of blood fell down to the surface of the ice block, huh? making it melt down. Hmm. My blood can melt this ice block down? Mm. Carwin immediately hugged the ice block. His blood and body warmth huh? made the ice block gradually huh? melt down. The cold entered his body, making him shiver, but he would never let go. Soon after, the ice block totally melted down, and the snow spirit was finally released. Hmm. You are really persistent. However, I am the one who created snow spirit. If she wants to leave, she will have to give me back her power and become a normal person. At that time, she will just be an ugly old woman. Huh? Huh? I love her so much, but I don't huh? want her to sacrifice that much. Hmm. I don't want to live in those cold days anymore. You made huh? me feel the warmth. If you don't mind, all I want is to be with you, even just for <laughs> one day. Era, I will never <laughs> let you down. Snow Queen, just to be together, we will accept everything. Alright, as you wish. The Snow Spirit immediately turned into an ugly huh? old woman. Huh? <laughs> now, get out of here quickly, before I change my mind. Carwin held Aira's hand so hmm. tight, together they run away from the palace. Hmm. Hmm? From now on, I won't let anyone take you away. He placed a sweet kiss upon her lips. <laughs> Much to his surprise, Aira turned back to the beautiful appearance as before. <laughs> Congratulations! You've just overcome the challenge. All the things I've done is just to make sure that the prince loves you by his heart. I will always follow and bless you. But if I know that you intend to betray Snow Spirit, I will definitely punish you. Thank you so much. I'll make Era the happiest girl in the world. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> then they lived happily forever after. <laughs> wow, fairy tales. <laughs> <laughs>